Patrick J. Michael, Senior Fellow in Environmental Studies at the Cato Institute and Distinguished Senior Fellow in the School of Public Policy at George Mason University. Gallup has been tracking public opinion on global warming <laughs> for some time. Uh, and when they first started tracking it, I think about 28% of the people said, would agree with the following statement. Global warming is real but exaggerated. Now 48% of people think that. And I have a feeling that Climate Gate probably had something to do with that. And also the incessant drumbeat in the media that this is the end of the world, this is the end of the world, when obviously it's not ending. I will give you a line chart of what it looked like from 1963 through 1987. There was this nice upward correlation. It was beautiful. But if I added the data in from 57, it went like this. Then it went up through 87 and down to 1995. So the correlation completely fell apart. And even Nature Magazine had to publish that. When I gave that as a presentation invited by the American Meteorological Society in January of 1997, Santa was in the audience. And my partner on the paper, who gave the second half of the paper, was sitting next to him. He didn't know who my partner was. And he kept on saying, oh, Michaels is an idiot, Michaels is an idiot. And then when I got done with the presentation, a very famous scientist reached out to shake my hand. I thought he reached out to shake my hand. And he said, if you ever give that presentation again, I'll wrap that microphone cord around your neck. 